Hi there, here's uh, one of the first examples we're going to be doing in the uh, equilibrium section. And uh, the first thing you always do whenever you have a problem is um, you draw a free body diagram. That's, that's the key. So I'm going to do that right now. Is I'm going to draw this beam. And then I'm going to make sure that I have um, all the details that I want. Now I know that this is going to be a pin. This is actually a pin joint, so I could put a, um, oh, I will. I'll do it right now. Here, it will go up here, just to show us. So I'm going to just call this, um, well, I don't know. We'll just go A and B. That's what I've been doing lately, right? So A, Y, and how about B, Y, and B, X, okay? And then you have uh, 10 pounds here, or 10 kips here, and 12 kips here. And by the way, kip is 1,000 pounds. A lot of people don't know that. So, okay, let's start off with our rules. We have uh, the sum of f of x is equal to 0, which is equal to just bx. So we know bx is equal to 0. That's simple enough. So now, sum of f of y, you're going to have ay plus by minus 10 minus 12 equals 0. Okay, well, that's two unknowns. We can't figure that out. we got to go into the uh, moments. So, all you do is you, you sit there and you go, okay, well, pick one. You could either do the moment at B or the moment at A, but you want to do one of them so that you cancel out one of those um, uh, one of those forces. So I'm just going to do moment at A because it's at the end, but you'll get the same result the other way. So 3 times negative 10 plus uh, 9 times B of Y and then plus 13 times negative 12. Okay. So um, this all will equal zero, right? To get our, our, our moment or whatnot. Um, basically, you got to get the moment equal to zero. So if we just work this out, what you're going to get is uh, negative 30, right? Negative 30 plus 9by and then minus, um, what is that one? 44 156 I'm thinking 156? I think that's right. I'm not sure if that's right. 156. <laughs> Having a mental breakdown here. Okay, so anyway. Uh, then you'll have 9y will equal... 9y will equal 180... or no, 186. Work your y out. Or sorry, your, this should be by. And your by will equal 186 divided by 9, which will be 20.667 kips, something like that. Okay, well, that means it's carrying a lot of the weight. But uh, we got to figure out what the reaction at A is. So... What we do is we just bring it back to the summation function, right? Sum of y f or is equal to 0 is equal to ay plus, here's b of y, 20.667, minus 10 minus 12 equals 0. And if you work out the arithmetic there, 
you'll find that your AY will equal 1.33 kips. Not too bad. Matter of fact, you'll find that you'll you'll cruise through these once you get comfortable with setting up the the layout. Once you set up the free body diagram, it, it's actually really um, I guess simple. So. Just get comfortable with free body diagrams because you're going to be doing them for a long while. I'll see you guys in the next video.